What did you do in the gym? But we mainly was on my walking. When you walking, yeah. Mm -hmm. So how did you do that? Um, with uh, with the frame. With the frame. Or with the parallel bars. And yeah. before that, it was the harness, wasn't it? Yeah. You had the harness and the ceiling, didn't you? Yeah. Which helped you walk around, didn't it? Made you feel more confident. Yeah. When you're in the harness. Yeah. So it made you feel like you wouldn't fall over, which was good. Yeah. Little bit scary. Because <laughs> you couldn't get your balance, or? No, because I couldn't get a balance. You couldn't get your balance, no. Yeah. <laughs> there were times when we, when we were asked to come in, and especially when she started to walk, you know, with a frame or with a stick, etc. Uh, you know, come and, have, you know, come and watch, you know, like we did when we videoed it in the corridor. And uh, the other nice thing is, of course, that um, uh, you know, when somebody starts to walk again or starts to recover, uh, you share that, especially at Marlborough, you share that with the other, the other uh, people who are, who are there undergoing similar sort of uh, treatment, if you like, and, uh, and they can see. So they all, you know, they all uh, feed off each other. Uh, which is a nice thing. So, yeah, to, I mean, physio, OT, speech and language, the other thing that was important as well was uh, uh, the psychological part of it as well, cause, uh, uh, and that's something that we're even talking about still now uh, with, with, the, with the current OT that comes to see us, uh, about Levi's, you know, how she feels. Uh, I think it's important for Levi, um, like it was at Marlborough, uh, where she had the opportunity to speak to a, you know, a psychologist, if you like, uh, that could talk to Levi about her concerns and about her worries. You know, outside of talking to mum and dad, talk to somebody else completely independent about how she was actually feeling, and and you know maybe maybe sort of tackle those feelings with somebody on a professional level as opposed to mum and dad and a family. The thing was for Levi was that as soon as she could, of course, she could get on social media, um, and she could stay in touch daily, hourly, minutely uh, with all her friends and, and family. And that was hugely important for Levi, wasn't it? To yeah. be able to go on Facebook. And that's the, one of the first things you said, wasn't it? When yeah. you started to become more aware of what was going on at Marbrook, you know, the first thing you said was, can I go on Facebook again? Yeah. And, 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 and you did, didn't you? Yeah. And you enjoyed that, didn't you? And you yeah. still do. <laughs> and now you're shopping on, 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 <laughs> on the internet, and that's a nightmare, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs>